Welcome back, guys. All right, we're going to do a little bit of a, a different Lego challenge. I'm nice. going to do uh, Rebels versus Imperials here. I got the X-Wing, uh, Pose X-Wing Fighter, uh, 75102, 717 pieces. So, Ooh. and then I've got a little bit of an advantage with the piece-wise. I've got Kylo Ren's X-Wing, or I guess TIE Fighter, sorry, not an X-Wing. Got a... Uh, Build 75179 with 630 pieces. Uh, uh, we both have the same amount of figs. I got yeah. Kylo. I've got a first order pilot, a first order stormtrooper, and a BB 9E. I got the the BB 8, uh, Poe himself, a resistance fighter, and a resistance ground crew. Uh, you have the much cooler set of figures, honestly, uh, with the Kylo Ren. Right uh, to the dark side. Yeah, but, uh, I don't know, I, I think I may have the advantage with the sweeter ship, but, uh, that tie's pretty sweet. Nevertheless, both these ships are going to be nice in our wild builds. Yes. Uh, just nice, nice sets overall. Uh, looks like we're getting lots of interesting features here. Ooh. Little carts. Uh, yeah, that's where all your extra pieces are. Yeah, uh, you don't have any of that, do you? I do not. Oh. I just have figures. Okay, fair enough. Uh, yeah, let's see how long it, uh, let's bust them open. Yeah. Uh, I'll open them up and I'll set a timer over here so I can keep up and once we get back with you, we can set a little timer. Pretty, pretty good pile of, pile of parts there. Ooh, nice thick book. But, uh, great. All right, we got them complete. Guess I'll reveal first. Coming in at a time of one hour and twenty minutes, somewhere around there. We have the TIE Fighter. Sweet little mm -hmm. bill. Got Rob Keen. Got this sweet little Storm Troopy. Got this little one. Got the little BB-8 or BB-90. Um, features on this. Got some cool shooting action. Wings kind of fold down. But other than that, pretty simple, straightforward build. This thing weighs. It's I don't know. It fun feels, for us. It feels like five pounds of Legos just in the center hall. Do the red things in the bottom not shoot, or are those just there for decoration? Nope, that's all decoration. Okay. Nope, they do shoot. Are you? Oh, yeah. Yeah, the yeah, thing you said. Yeah. But I don't have any like little guns or anything. Those are the only two projectiles. Oh. Lots of areas where you could add some stuff, but nothing that shoots. What's well, potential there? The back is so, cool. Back is pretty cool. You can see the the clear yeah. with a, some weird toe hitch on the back. Uh, yeah. So in the back of that, there are some McDonald yellow Legos back there. I guess. The reason why is to brighten all this up. Maybe. That makes sense. Genius. Yeah. Uh, I like the Toe Witch. That's, that's probably my favorite yeah. part so far. The front looks really good with those uh, two clears. Only had two stickers on the on entire thing. Me and here. <laughs> but yeah, solid. I liked it. It's, all, it, it's a useful set. It's a set yeah. you can actually enjoy and play with unlike so many other I sets. I see... Oh. Uh, Gundam shields. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> Definitely some potential there. That would be a big problem. Uh, yeah, that's <laughs> a two foot Gundam. <laughs> hey, Alright. Right. Let's see well, what we got says. Pose. And first, before we quite, uh, quite reveal this, we got the best part. We've got the repair shuttle. And the ladder. Sweet. Which might be the worst Lego toy ever. Uh... Little shuttles, okay. I actually like the shuttle's feet because it's supposed to hover. Got some really neat clear 
cover action there go the, the ladder's stupid uh toolbox extra ammo and cool pretty neat it's on a single uh i guess it's meant to come off real easy huh. yeah kind of starting to get a wrench for no good reason uh and Those shields like we did with the uh mm -hmm. other ones none of yeah. them have shields yeah that's a real my missed opportunity i feel yeah, yeah they kind of got a shield it's built in. Never mind. Alright. And here we go. This pose X Wing, BB 8. We got a pretty sweet pose figure. Uh built in built in shield. And, uh special helmet. I assume that he's the only one with that helmet. Uh interesting cockpit. We got these guns right off the bat that release really oddly. I assume there's a bit of a trick. Ah, oh, that's neat. Uh, we've also got some quick shooters. Those, uh, those don't go anywhere. Um, awesome little fold up foot so when he takes off. And once you get taken off, you can fly in the fly mode. Rubber bands keeping that really solid. First time I've seen rubber bands used. Yes. Uh, well, I think there were some old Technic sets that used mm -hmm. them, but it, it unusual for a newer set. Um, kind of a complicated little mechanism, honestly, because you have to have so much tension to keep it running. Um, these angles here, which was a really strange piece to build, that was actually using some scissor pieces. Worked out really well. Looks great. Uh, this was a strange piece to build, but I think it looks really good. Um, sticker top, stickers there. Lots of stickers on this one. Uh, I don't think there's a printed piece outside of maybe the canopy. The canopy not take stickers. I say the canopy's printed. The rest of it's not. Um, cool little light feature on the back for the back burners. These look like just some lost potential here, kind of like on yours. I think there could have been something there. Um, had a few more pieces, so my time was closer to, I think it was 147. Um, overall, a really cool, useful set. Fun set. Cool to have a small army of these. Um... These just look like absolute add-ons to me. Um, I'm glad when they do that, but just just seems odd. It does scale really well. The ladder actually is a functional ladder. That looks like a, a normal cart. If you were if you were setting up a base build, I, I think those could be very interesting. Like sure. a, Speaking of size comparison, I'm not sure I swing. I'm not sure. I'm, how much? They're pretty close uh, overall. Or smaller. The next wing is. But. I mean, they're they're within an inch. Uh, width width is about the same. So overall, they're they're comparative to each other, which is really all I can ask for. Pretty cool. Good solid sets. Uh, a lot of fun doing it. I like a set that's not only fun to build, but it's something that's actually a, a toy at the end of the day. There's so many sets I see that are just strange little train or diorama sets that just don't look fun to me. Where these these I actually can see. I mean, this this is not that much different than a... The house scale. This guy would be... Does not scale well. It, uh, does not scale well at all. <laughs> Uh, any yeah. final comments? Yeah, I think we're good. I, I do think we're good. I'd say until next time. Yeah. I think we got another couple of Star Wars builds, another three and one. We got, we got a lot, lot of Batman stuff got coming lots up. Lots of Batman stuff coming so. up. Uh, lots of fun stuff in general coming up. So like and subscribe. We'll see you next time. Yeah.